been working on the garage slash shop. Like I say, it's going to end up being uh, 30 by 35 and a half, two stories, so to have a, a complete 7 by 16 foot uh, storage up above. And that's what the, the old style uh, barn roof, gambler roof, I think they're called, or something like that. But that allows me to get lots of upstairs storage going down here. And I'm not good at walking in a construction site holding the camera trying to video. Guess I should have went to the hairstylist before coming out today, but that's life. But down here we had the gas line in the way and thought it was going to have to be moved and fought it the whole time. But it ends up being okay, I think. So I'll go ahead and show you that real quick. Here's my first trench I'm working on. I'm gonna try to do one side at a time. Got some stuff up there to move, then I'll go from where the compactor is over to there. Or this one goes from here over to there. So I'm not for sure which one I'll do first, but what I did is ran the compactor up and down this probably six times on each side. And then I soaked it down because I got to put another four inches of dirt on it, so I don't really be working in the mud. Uh, it just helps it compact. And the dirt is kind of dry, so it's kind of dusty too. But like I say, I'll, I'll fill in another four inches of dirt, then run the compactor back and forth on it, and then kind of fine tune it where all my marks are. Uh, this is a video of my shop that I'm doing, so it ended up being 30 by 35 and a half is all the le city let me do here in my backyard. Gonna have a like a barn style roof, a gambler roof. But I got all my footings down, they ended up being 16 wide, 8 deep, with 3 rebars in them for 2 story. Should get my wall panels up in the next day or so. And didn't get them poured this week so I can start on all the groundwork and try to get this done before winter time. And that's that way. That's all my pond filtration stuff for my pond over there but it walks down this way kind of real smoky up here this is in Washington from all the fires you can barely see the Sun up there but that's just how bad it is here with all the fires they say it's supposed to blow away in the here so gonna have a 12 foot door back here coming in off the alley but this is it's kind of the mess where it's at work in progress you got as much stuff as I do, you got to just shift it to get something built to put it in. So there's my gas line going down to the house. Uh, it's actually just plastic. But that's in it. should bend over enough to miss my wall once you push it over. But that gas line right there has 35 pounds of pressure in it. And you can't run it in your slab or nothing, so like I say, I think we're gonna get away with just pushing it over. There's my other plumbing down there, which goes up to my waterfall and stuff. Here's the rock out here, he has fun with all the trenches and stuff. All right, yeah, yeah, uh, he has a good time, but. Pretty soon my mounds of dirt will be gone. All that smoke up there will be gone. And all my crusty 
sheds and pile up the stuff would be gone and all be organized and put inside my garage. But when you hit with the city, you got limitations. Like, see, I tried to do a little bit bigger and they wouldn't let me. Well, time's getting short and we gotta go. So we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Oh, in case you forgot, remember to subscribe. See you later. Bye.